Good morning, morning pioneers. pioneers. Today is March 4th, 2016. She's the Queen Nizreen. And he is the Majestic Matthew. And, and this, this is, is the Pioneer, Pioneer Press, Press Daily, Daily Edition. Edition. Ah, Nizreen, can't you just feel the love in the air? What love? In the air. Well, I do know today is National Hug a GI today. Yay! Come and spread your love. I would love to, to hug Sergeant Tolliver and spread my love. Or Cacciato, right, Mr. Tom? <laughs> okay, enough with those AP lit jokes. And now on to our flashback. This little cutie is, is a junior and is currently sitting in Miss Castle's second period English class. Can you guess who it is? And now for my favorite part of the show, general announcements. Seniors, do you need some cash? For some college expenses, C come to the counseling office today. Pick up a Walter P. Foreman, also known as Uncle Walt, scholarship application. The due the deadline is to submit to Miss Rofi in the counseling office by March 24th. Cool, and this is just a reminder that today is the last day to turn in your ASB appointed applications. By 3 p.m. to the ASB room, make sure to get those in, Pios. You can neither win nor lose if you don't run to the race. So that means you should go sign up to the annual Western Color Run. All proceeds to go to the Leukemia Lymphoma Society. So what better way to help those in need? The Color Run will be this Saturday, March 5th, and you can sign up today, either run or volunteer by simply picking up a forum in the ASB room. Make sure you sign up, Pios. And today is the last day for Pennies for Patients. Students, make sure your teacher is passing around the box around throughout all periods. And teachers, if you know your box is feeling a little empty, Help your students out by donating as well. Any money will help. Remember to give bucks because cancer sucks. Are you creative? Well, we got an activity for you. Every year to start off International Week, Pioneers decorate our lovely floors to school with a beautiful and colorful chalk art. You can draw anything that highlights your own cultural her heritage or supports the International Week theme. One world, one love. If you want to be part of this, part, if you want to participate in the chalk art this year, please draw and submit your art to Miss Moen in room 40 by March 23rd. Get those drawings in, piles. And breaking news, this just in, something about prom. What? Now to deliver a special message, Steven, roll it, roll it, roll it, roll it. Well, yeah, I know, John. I gotta change my stylist meeting, my what tux guy. You know, I gotta take care of that, and the whole world no. guy's gonna be changed. But you know, no, not much we can do. You know, it's inconvenient, but oh, hey, piles. Uh, big announcement: prom has been moved from the 30th of April to the 23rd of April, a week ahead. I know it's a big inconvenience, but it's still gonna be a great night. And more information like theme and location will be disclosed later. So it's going to be a great night. Make all the necessary arrangements to move it a week ahead. And uh, have a great time, pal, and be there. It's going to be the biggest event all year. All right, John? Yeah. Thank you for that special announcement, ASB. Now you girls know when to book your makeup. And now for my favorite part of the show, clubs. clubs! Just a reminder, Anaheim Achieves mentors, you will be walking over to Twilery today, meet with Mandy in the Media Center today at 3.30 p.m. to discuss the schedule for the next two weeks. Mm -hmm. And for Anaheim Achieves, happy program moment is here. Is another free thing to look forward to is Cosmetology Club. Ask your Ooh. YMCA staff or YSB leader about it. Happy Friday from your Y family. They'll see you after school for more fun games. Calling all Planeteers, it's Friday, which means we are collecting recycling. See you all after school in room 51. Christian Club members, we left off with a topic that, that we'll all like to, do, to elaborate on. So don't miss out on today's meeting. Come on out to room 51 and join in. Hey, freshman year Link Crew leaders have been working real hard to put together an Easter egg hunt just for you guys starting Monday, March 7th. Now here's a quick video. Steven? Steven! Found eggs. Oh, haven't you heard, kiddo? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> haven't you heard, kiddo? The Easter egg hunt is coming to Western, all right? And Link Crew's been putting together a very special uh, event just for you guys. There's gonna be Easter egg all around campus starting March 7th, which is Monday. And if you find a ticket, just go take it over to the attendance office with your ID. Here, there's a special one for you. Take it over with your ideas and show them that you're a freshman like you. And you're a big freshman at that, too. And uh, take it. There could be homework passes, mile passes, stadium passes, a pass to get a free whole pizza. And then um, just a bunch of them just have candy, you know? So it's going to be really exciting starting March 7th. Are you excited, kiddo? Yeah! Looming, springtime's looming. Everything is coming alive. Easter colors, yellow. 
supplies are limited, limited, so don't let them run out before you claim them. Get searching, freshmen. Get searching, you guys. Attention all dance clubbers, there will be a mandatory International Week dance practice today after school in front of room 16. Please make sure you are there and ready to dance. And also don't forget to go to Japanese club today during lunch in room 54. Bring bring your friends pios. And now for my favorite part of the show, hashtag pio press. Wait, why is it your favorite? Because I stopped talking for a minute. Steven Wallet! <laughs> And don't forget, next week we'll be airing your craziest face swaps to make sure you send those guys in. And now for my favorite part of the show, sport! Western Pioneer Varsity Baseball team opened up the, net, the Newport Elks tournament with 3-1 victory of the Cavalry Chapel. Junior pitcher Chris Morgan pitched a complete game, one hitter to earn his first victory in the season. In a close 1-1 -one -one game in the sixth inning, inning senior Mark Quinn trip, uh, got right in the center gap scoring Garrett Scott from first base. Two batters later, Anthony Huerta hit a deep, deep sacrifice in the fly, hitting scoring uh, Huin to the end of the scoring. Your Pioneers played a complete game and quality pitching, outstanding defense, and perfect offense execution. The team is now 3-0 on the season and plays Rancho Alamitos this Saturday at 1. Come on out and support your Pios. Come support, and now for my favorite part of the show, the end! Uh, but we still have our flashback, and it's drum roll. It's Trista Murphy! She likes to hang out with her friends. Her favorite class is child development, and in 10 years, she sees herself as a registered nurse. If you would like to be featured as our next Wayback Throwback or Flashback, don't forget to tag us on your favorite social media platform using at the Pio Press. Don't forget about hashtag Pio Press. Stay classy. Enjoy that long-deserved weekend. And remember, don't do drugs. Eat a breakfast. Make someone smile. And press, press on, on, Pios! Whee! Oh, this is the army, Mr. Green.